Hey what's up hater fans, welcome back to another hater video, now in today's video we are going to be playing this mod called Halo 3 The Banish mod. Now when I was playing this I was really really was really impressed by the visuals on how the brutes looked, like it really does make you feel like you are part of the banished brute you know. And he did such an amazing job, I forgot I forgot the guy's name who created this, my bad, I, I'll definitely leave his name in the bottom description but damn, like the guy who made this you did such a good job dude. Uh, I really love the armors, like the colour. The colour looks so good. So bluey and <laughs> so reddish. Oh wow. I'm playing as the brute chieftain, the the guy who holds the gravity hammer. This is pretty dope. It makes me think that, you know, they should have um, actually included, you know, playboy brutes for you know for the future hater titles, you know? I wonder if we can find Craig. Is Craig here? Hey Craig, is that you? No, that's not you. Are you Craig? Nah, Craig's not here guys. But really though, if you look at this mod, like I know this mod doesn't really change, you know, the gameplay or anything or... But yeah, but like the visuals, you know, I know it's just the visuals, you know, are the only difference. It's just skins. But for some reason it does make, it does make you feel like a different game. Like I really love what he's done to the colours. Well I'm playing this on normal. Forgive me if I'm so bad. Let's get a carbine. Yeah. I like how you get to see the brute's arm. FB FB arm. It's pretty cool. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna start doing more mods, uh modded videos. Uh I have some in the works, so if you guys are enjoying this, be sure to you know subscribe and leave a like. I would definitely do more Halo uh, videos. Okay, so we're fighting elites. Okay, that's cool. I really miss uh, fighting elites, like in Halo 3. I mean, I know you get to fight them in the other Halo games. Like in Halo 4 and 5. But I really wish, you know, Halo 3 allowed you to fight elites in the campaign. Yeah, this is so cool how you get to play alongside with the brutes. I wonder if we ever get like a, a spin off Halo game. Of you know playing as a brute, maybe once um, um, once after Halo Infinite is out, maybe we get like a DLC of playing as a banished brute. I would love to see that, bro. I, I wish I had a BR man. I really need a battle rifle. Oh my god, look at that needler! <laughs> hey, look, I can do with needlers. Oh my god, I'm actually doing wielding. That looks so freaky. The guy is holding it. <laughs> That's so weird. Yeah, I haven't really played a lot of this. I just played the beginning bit. Oh my god, look at this. Look how fast he's moving with the freaking turret that's been detached. That's so awesome, man. <laughs> look how he jumps. Oops, sorry. Uh, I was killing my own teammate. I'm supposed to kill an elite. Oh man, I, I do apologize that I don't remember the guy who made this mod. Very silly, not for not remembering his name. But yeah, he did such a, a you know a very good job making this mod. It's pretty weird fighting elites in Halo 3's campaign because we never actually fought them in this uh, in this game. Oh god, don't shoot me! I'll probably die because I am playing this on normal. Man. You can literally sprint with this turret, not sprint, but like you can literally, you know, move, you know, a lot faster than you do with the Master Chief and the Orbiter. Can I do wheel? Wait. Yeah, you can do wheel normally with these weapons. I wonder how he looks. You can use theater to look uh, to look at your own. Um, sorry, wrong team. Yeah, you can hop in theater and actually uh, look at yourself, playing as the brute. That's pretty dope. Hey, Liz, let me use that turret. Ah, oh, the jump. I can't. Do you know every time I jump, I can't really move forward? Let me use this turret. Literally, you can move a lot faster just using this turret. I can see why they, they, they won't include playable brutes. I mean, I'm sure they can tweak, tweak them down or something. Do you hear that? I don't like it. Look how he jumps. <laughs> That's pretty, that's pretty hilarious. And by the way, I'm playing this. Uh, I'm using the controller, playing this mod because 
Every time I use a mouse and keyboard, like it makes a lot of noises, like in the back, you know, in the background, when I'm when I'm recording. Oh shit! Wrong, <laughs> oh wrong player. My bad. Was not meant to do that. Oh, it's the, the swapped with the marine. Okay. Wait, what? Marines not in my team? Well, that's a plot twist. Marines are working with the banish. Oh god, I'm gonna die. Do I have a deployable cover? Yes, I do. Oh shit, you can't shoot through that? Not with the plasma rifle, I don't think. I need to carb I need to cover on carb There you go. Wait, what? I can't even shoot through that? I think I think this mod is different, I don't know. This mod is very different. Oh man. Kill those buggers, guys, come on. I really hate buggers in this game. In all the Halo games. Uh, they, just, they just don't stay in one place, you know? Super frustrating. Hey guys, what's up? Hello, Grunt. Oh, I can't betray him. Oh, wait. What the hell? <laughs> look at the Grunt. <laughs> what? Are you guys looking at this? <laughs> he, has a, he has a Covenant Carbine under his freaking armor. Is that... <laughs> Look at him. Need, need a little help there, pal? Look at my plasma... Look at... Oh my god, that's so weird. Look how I'm firing my plasma pistol. Okay, it's going bent. Oh my god. That's a bit creepy. I think that's as a weapon back, isn't it? This is awesome, man. Like, I like it. I like the armor of this. Gold armor. I really hope, you know, uh, these kind of mods do show T43 that, you know, there's a lot of potential, you know, playing as a, as a brute, you know? And maybe sometimes in the future we probably will get a DLC campaign playing as a brute. Because we have one for a Spartan, we have one for, you know, the Elite, you know, playing as the Arbiter, we have one for the ODST playing as the Rookie. So, I totally to believe we will probably see a, um, a campaign playing as a brute. Oh my god, such a weird throw. Oh, I was I thought that was a deployable cover, my bad, but I use it anyways. And get to my turret. Oh god, I died, man. Come on. Alright, round two, let's go. This is for Craig. Oh, that's a poor throw. I think the animation, uh, the animations for this brute isn't too, um, it's not too stable, you know, it's a bit bugged out. I do apologize if you guys can't hear the in-game audio, um, I did kind of seem to tweak tweaked it all the way down. Oh god, here comes energy sword, shows what you got bro, ha ha ha, that's a nice looking elite color though, look at that, nice golden elite. Yeah, you did it such a good job with the colors. Oh my god, oh my god. Shoot that guy, man. I don't know why I'm so stuck on this part. Man, fighting, fighting at least can be such a pain in the ass to deal with, even on normal. Maybe because I'm playing as a brute, but still the boots are OP, so I should like, do this without breaking a sweat. All right. Finally. Took us a while to kill those damn brutes. I mean, elites, I meant. I really hate when Katana appears. There, there, also, there, are, there is a mod where you, where you can actually, uh, actually move faster, even if Katana does appear in front of your screen. Hey, hey. Hey, can I borrow that? Can he actually use a sword? Oh, sick! He can use a sword. Wait, wait. Look, look what happened to him. Is he glitch? He's under the ground? Hey. This is awesome. Oh! <laughs> a brute goes flying instead of a marine. I find that quite hilarious. Oh, shit! Why do I keep... Sorry man, I was not meant to kill my own teammate. Uh, I keep getting mixed up. I keep thinking I'm fighting the brutes. Oh god, I'm gonna die. 
That's awesome how how Oh okay, so the so the guy that I gave the sword to is actually the version of the Orbiter. Okay, that's that's pretty dope. I like that. Man, he can run so fast with this guy with channel. Oops! No no no, these guys are my teammates. Sorry guys. Sorry little buddy. Don't need to kill you. Ugh. Can you climb up this ladder? Oh you pathetic brute, you can't you, you can't even climb for Oh my god, I died as well. Can I teabag? <laughs> I think I could teabag. See how I was teabagging. Look. Oh stop shooting me. I'm trying to show people my teabag. I have few man, I'm making the run for this. I'm waiting for my health to charge up. Okay, let's go. Goodness me, those guys are such pain in the ass. Wait. Okay, this part I'm gonna fight. Will I fight Jetpack Brutes or Jetpack Elites? I don't know, that's interesting. I'll probably fight the buggers. But yeah, I do see a lot of potential playing as a Brute. I really do hope that we get like a spin-off Halo game playing as a Brute. That's nice, look at that. Banish the Phantom, that's pretty sweet. Whoa. Oh, that's clever. Okay, we're fighting brutes, but they're like green. Okay. I thought we'd be fighting buggers since they do fly around. Is that it? Wait a minute. No, they're, all, they're, they're coming from up there actually. Let's kill all these guys. Alright, let's go. Nope! Oh my god, it's about to fall off my days. Oh my god. That's so cool, man. He did such a good job of, uh, you know, nailing the colour right. Look at that. That's pretty sweet. That's, jo that's Johnson, by the way, the gold in that boot. <laughs> what? Uh, that's. Oh my god, Katana, get out of my screen. Look what he's onto this uh, Prowler. He actually, obviously you can't see because it's kind of destroyed. But that's like a ban that's a banished Prowler. That's pretty nice. It's got nice red colours on it. Yeah, he does such a fantastic job with this mod. Oh wow, now I'm killing Grunts. Okay. Make up your mind. Alright. Oh my god. I don't have shields. I need to wait for my shield to recharge. Okay, let's go. Uh, so yeah, if you guys are curious uh, how I'm playing this mod, I'm playing this on PC. It's not on consoles. I'm just using the controller, so you guys might be thinking, you know, oh, he's actually, you know, playing this mod on consoles. Not true. Just on PC, guys. Just using the Xbox controller because my keyboard makes too much noises and I don't really like that. Oh, that's a good stick. Oh no, I didn't stick anyone. Oh man, thought I did. Oh, that's a, that's a, I threw that too far, man. Okay, we're almost done with this mission. Almost. Whoa! How did I kill them there? Oh, okay, it's my trip mine. All right, they're almost sort of like, you know, tracked back a bit. Okay. Be careful! There's a minefield out there, guys. <laughs> Come on, Lee. Can you touch me? No, you can't. Oh shit! Sure, we have a sword guy that's really pissed. Let's turn on the bomb. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what the elevator is, Johnson. Don't need to tell me, bro. Ah, oh, God. I missed that jump. So instead, we have uh, jackals running around and not grunts. Okay. Obviously, this mod doesn't really like dramatically changes everything, you know? 
it's not that extreme but still like this guy did a really good job you know making this mod i'm really looking forward to you know seeing the other mods in the future like um because you know because 250 will want official mod support to happen for um, halo mcc i'm just hoping I'm, I'm honestly hoping the mods the modding level will be the same the same level as custom edition that's what i'm really praying for Man, I've been stuck on this mission for like 24 minutes. This this mission seems seems to be a bit short. Well, it depends on what difficulty you're playing on, obviously. But still, even on normal, I should complete this in no time. All right. Nice, we made it, guys. I believe Bungie never slowed down Cortana. Will make the game so much better. Okay guys, uh, thank you guys for stopping by, uh, be sure to subscribe and like the video and be sure to follow me on Twitch, I'm always going to be streaming Halo on Twitch literally every day, so be sure to follow us on there and I'll uh, see you Halo fans in the next video, bye.